Let's do another problem involving the average rate of change of a function. For this one, we'll use the function negative x cubed plus 2x minus 1, and we're interested in its average rate of change between x equals 1 and x equals 3. So remember that in order to do this, we have to basically look at our first point, x equals 1, and then how far away it is so we can do that difference quotient. So I'm going to say that x1 is at 1. The distance between these two points, h, is basically 2 away. So when I do the piece where I need x1 plus h in my difference quotient, I'll add these two values together and use 3. All right, let's write down that difference quotient and then plug in all of these particular points. So I'm looking at f of x1 plus h minus f of x1 all over h. Okay, so x1 plus h is 3, so I'll need to plug 3 into my function. x1 is 1, so I will plug 1 into the function. And of course, I'll look at all of this over 2. After doing some quick calculations, 3 uh, cubed and 3 multiplied by 2, subtracting those things because of the negative sign, I'll get a negative 22. When you plug 1 into all of this, it looks like you get 0. And we'll evaluate this all over 2. So negative 22 all over 2, or negative 11. So basically the average rate of change for this particular function uh, between 1 and 3 is negative 11.